Welcome to part two of getting your Moultrie Mobile set up. So we just got done activating an account. You've confirmed your email address and this is the screen that you have landed on. So the next step is to activate a modem. If you chose to activate a modem at this point in the process, you would click this button. But should you have decided to wait and activate it later, or if you have another modem that you want to activate on down the road, here is how you go to activate a modem. Come up to the top here, select the My Account button, you'll see a drop down, and then you're going to scroll down to the Activate Modem section. You'll click that, and then it will take you to this screen where you will add your serial number and modem ID. You're going to find this information on the back of your modem on a big white label. Enter that information in, click Next, then you're going to choose your data plan. So you'll see that you have various data plans that you can choose, how much data is associated to each of them, the average number of pictures that you're going to get, and the monthly cost for that plan. So choose one of the plans, and then here at the bottom, you're going to click Next. If this is the first time you're setting up a modem, you're going to be prompted to add a credit card. This is the only time that you'll have to add a credit card. It's just to put one on file on your account. Enter everything as you would. You're going to find the CVC on the back of the card. It's going to be the three or four digit number on the back of the card toward the end of the signature line. Once you enter this information, click Save. There will be a drop down box that will pop up and show you the status of your card activating and will let you know once it has saved. After you click Save, you will be bounced back into your cart for your modem activation. This is going to be very, very important. Um, before you are done activating your modem, you must click Purchase. But before we click Purchase, just a couple things to look at. You're going to see the serial number and modem ID that you entered, the plan that you selected, how much that monthly plan costs, and how much data you get for that. If everything looks good there, then click Purchase. And once everything has processed successfully, you will get this successful activation message here in green, plus the confirmation here, down here at the bottom. And you click Done, and you are good to go.